Hello, my friends. I am Humberto Fernandez, your real estate broker in the Riviera Maya. And what happens if you're taking a vacation here in Playa del Carmen and you suddenly get an injured or you fall sick? Well, don't worry, as I got you covered. For today, we're going to be looking into the different health services available in the city. And as always, just a friendly reminder to like and subscribe and stay with me. So let's say that you're staying in a hotel just like this. So then your first line of defense is just right there. As hotels, they have medical staff on site pretty much 24 seven, and they would be able to help you out with first aid and minor injuries, not much more than that anyways. But if the situation escalates, they will be able to refer you to a bigger hospital where you will get all of the attention that you need. And so if you're in the need of basic services or you need a medical consultation and you don't want to break the bank, the doctors here at these pharmacies, Farmacias del Ahorro or uh, farmacias similares, they may just be the option for you. And when I say that they are not expensive, I'm talking in the realm of 10 to $15. Also, these pharmacies, they are all over town, so most likely there's gonna be one close to you. And just a little pointer, if you're in need to refill your, your prescription medication, you can just come by, see the doctor, explain your situation, and most likely he would be able to refill your prescription medication. Just keep that in mind, a little downside here, and that is that they may not speak English and also th there may be a long wait so just keep that in mind. So in a little upscale from the regular Farmacia del Ahorro and Farmacias Similares, I would like to very much recommend to you this Farmacia Similares that is on Juarez Avenue and 25th. As for they offer the same basic services that they would offer in any other Farmacia Similares, however they do have a lab here where they offer a full assortment of clinical tests from blood and urine tests to all the way through through ECGs, ultrasounds, x-rays, and everything that you need. And so just a little pointer, if you happen to need some of those uh, clinical tests, and even if you're getting service at another private hospital, it's a good idea to come here. As for this is truly not expensive at all. And so if you're looking for a medical consultation in the downtown area here in Playa del Carmen, the walk-in clinic may just be the best alternative for you. He, they work 24 seven and Dr. Bernardo, and I, I can say for personal experience, they offer an outstanding service, outstanding service. We're here located on 20th uh, Street between 1st and 5th Avenue. And so they speak English and they are very focused on foreigners. So if you ever need a medical consultation, this is the place to come here in downtown Playa del Carmen. And this is a Merimed in El Ejido, right on the Federal Highway. And here, this is not a full hospital, but they do offer a broad range of services. However, here it starts being on the expensive side of the equation. However, it is a very foreigner oriented hospital that they will speak English. So here you would come if you need care that requires a little bit more than just a simple clinic, but yet don't expect to get major surgery here. And right here, this is Playa del Carmen General Hospital, which is by far the biggest and most complete hospital in Playa del Carmen, located in El Ejido. Here, the services range from anything between a simple medical consultation all the way up to major surgery. Now, from a price point perspective, here it's not expensive per se, but the amounts can escalate depending on the services that you need. Now, this is the place if you get into some major accident or you have a major health event like a stroke or a heart attack, whatnot, probably this is the place where the ambulance will bring you. Now, here the thing is, you should not expect a very welcoming and pampering service. And also being run by the government, you can expect some Mexican bureaucracy that can get a little bit frustrating and annoying at times. And that one right there, located in this cute little plaza within the gated community of Playa Car, is Playa Car Medical Center. They are open 24 seven and they offer basic medical consultation. However, it may be very convenient if you are within the gated community of Playa Car. And of course, they're very foreigner oriented and they speak every language that you can imagine. And this one right here is Costa Med, which is one of the most popular options, if that even makes any sense. It is located on the Federal Highway in around 
the Playa Car area. In here they offer a full range of services, including dental, which is not offered in many of the other options. In here it is a little bit expensive, but you can expect a magnificent service. They are foreigner oriented, so you can expect them to speak your language. And just as a little side note, if you happen to pass out on Fifth Avenue after a wild night, it's very likely that you end up here. And my friends, this one right here is Hospitén, which is, according to some sources, the best hospital in Playa del Carmen. It is located on the Federal Highway right outside of Playa Car. And here they offer a full range of services from basic consultation to surgery. Here it is a little bit expensive. And yes, if things get complicated, you may expect to be breaking the bank. However, they are ready to service foreigners and they speak several languages. So my friends, this has been just a little tour through some of of the most important medical facilities here in the city of Playa del Carmen. Of course, there are a lot that we cannot cover just for the length of this video. There are a lot of pharmacies. There are a lot of small clinics that, yeah, we just didn't cover them in this video. However, the main goal of this video is to give you some peace of mind, knowing that when you're visiting here Playa del Carmen and something happens, there are enough healthcare facilities to take care of all and every of your needs. And in any case, if you have ever been visiting one of those uh, uh, facilities please uh, I would love to know your comments in the comment section let me know how was the service let me know how was the attention and so I would really love to hear that from you so my friends as always don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe that helps this channel a lot and to the next one